In this video, I want us to explore the moon button in this Gondox X33. How this moon button functions so that you can set up your flash trigger the right way. Right now, you can see from group A, B, C, D, and A, nothing is highlighted. And when nothing is highlighted, when I press the moon button, it goes between high speed sync denoted by this sign here. When I press it again, it goes to multi flash. When we look at the, the flash itself, you can see that when nothing is highlighted here, even on the flash. nothing is on for instance when I press the modern button you can see it goes to M on the flash itself when I press it again it goes to multi flash but at the same time you can see all of them are off and the reason why they are off is because nothing is highlighted here on the flash trigger which is commanding this flash. Now in multi flash, if I press group A, you can see that I have highlighted A but I have not set anything on group A. I have just highlighted. In this case, when I press the moon button, it goes to on. So when it is set to on, I will need to press the set button. And I can dial in the settings that I want my multi flash to operate under. In this case, my multi flash is set to 1 but when date power 17 hertz and 30 flashes. So in this case when I press the test button the flash is supposed to produce 30 flashes. The flash will produce 30 flashes. to get out of multi flash what I need to do is ensure that nothing is highlighted here and then press the mount button and now I am in high speed sync and on the flash you can see that it is in manual mode but it is off the reason why it is all it is off on the flash itself is because nothing has been selected here. So let me select group C. You can see that it is still off on the flash. But then when I click set, so before I click set, I need to select mode. It is still here. In detail, the flash is still off. When I press mode again in manual mode, the flash is still off. When I click set, the flash is still off. The reason why nothing is happening is because on the flash here, it is set to group A and on the trigger here, I have set it to group C. So, you also have to take note of group settings between the flash and the flash trigger. So, I have pressed the test button and nothing was happening, so I entered to check and it is set to group A here. So, what I need to do is press the group button and set it to group C. The 
Studio Passion now. The brush is bearing in group C at 1 over 8. And here it is also 1 over 8. So that is how you use the mode button with this Gondrox X2 trigger. JM Photography Vacation Image Me